Can I get 10 copies? Put them on the pile. Uh, no, they're for Arthur. I need them like 15 minutes ago, so if you wouldn't mind. You're the toilet paper guy. Wait, who's that? That's April. Yes, I am in fact the toilet paper guy. Feel free to call me the bagel and coffee guy. Or Todd in accounting calls me Crystal, which I'm, I'm pretty sure is a girl's name. How many copies? 10. These. These? Yeah, both of those. What made you become a Bill Clinton supporter? I'm not. This is a money game. I get paid 12 an hour, which is better than babysitting, which is what I've been doing way too much of. Uh, you're a Democrat, right? Why does everyone have to be a Democrat or a Republican? I'm struggling with a copy machine. No, oh, hold on. You're an independent, aren't you? I am nothing. Why am I obligated to be something? Why do I have to have an opinion about everything anyway? I mean, really, what do I know about missile systems or social security or the tax code? What about civil rights or uh, women's rights? A woman's right to do what she wants with her body. What about that? I do what I want with my body. That's, that's apathetic. I'm not apathetic. Yes, you are. I'm not. I just know that these bozos you're working for, they don't care about anything more than their own ambition. That's absolutely not true. You think this guy Bill Clinton is going to make a huge difference? I do. He's going to do what's already inevitable. Okay, that's where you're wrong. Don't make me staple your head. You're wrong. He's going to make a difference with African Americans. He's going to make a difference with women. He gets women. Oh my God. I mean, look at his record in Arkansas. Read his plans on health care. Read his plans on education. Okay. Oh my or, God. Or don't. I'm sorry. You know. Yeah. I yeah. Just I'm sorry. Asleep. I'm yeah. really sorry. That's fine. Oh. Wake up to a new America. This I believe you. Really interesting. Fine. You convince me. You're nothing. I'm nothing. Yes, I was Bill Clinton's lover for 12 years. And for the past two years, I have lied to the press about our relationship to protect him. The truth is, I loved him. Oh, now he tells me to deny it. Well, I'm sick of all of the deceit, and I'm sick of all of the lies. When you write about one thing, he certainly gets women. This has been fun. <laughs> yeah. Bye, toilet paper guy. Bye, coffee girl. Oh my god, it never ends. They just keep playing it over and over and over it's again. It's gonna blow over again. People don't really care about this stuff. That's oh, the thing. I don't understand. I've heard Bush has a mistress. Uh, Everybody's talking about it, so why is it okay for him and not for Clinton? She's trashy. <laughs> I mean, her hair alone is enough reason to go after Clinton. Big deal. Everyone has their weaknesses, you know? Those chubby redheads with the long fake fingernails? <laughs> oh, that's what daddy likes. <laughs> oh, that's just nasty. Yes, you are unfailingly repugnant. Hey, it's a coincidence. I love women that say unfailingly repugnant. You know what I love? I love long-haired brunettes with horn-rimmed glasses. I have no idea why. They're like kryptonite to me. <laughs> I got that one, too.